if you've been having problems with your new PC glitching somehow with your DJ software, maybe you're bench testing the machine and it's freezing up after a half hour, 45 minutes, maybe your waveforms are glitchy, you can have all kinds of different problems with this. There's a lot of things you can try to do to fix the problem, but I found one thing in particular that works. It worked for me anyway, and it's worked for some of my friends that I wanted to share with you today. Before we get into this fix, I just need to let you know that I am not a PC, computer, tech of any kind. Sure says technician, I'm not that guy. I'm just cosplaying right now. So I'm gonna share with you what worked for me, and it may work for you too. This is a problem that Alienware machines are having. I've got an M16, a friend of mine has an M18. He had a very similar issue. I turned him onto this fix and he has no more problems. When you set up your new PC for DJing, sometimes you have to change the power plan of your machine to work well with your DJ software. Not that these software programs particularly use a lot of power, but it's good to go with the performance option when you're selecting a power plan. When you go to do that, sometimes you don't get the performance option. You only get this balanced option. And what the balanced option does apparently is it switches between low power and high power very quickly to save energy. And this might be fine if you're playing Call of Duty at the coffee shop. But if you're DJing in front of an audience, it may cause problems with your programs and it may be just a very bad thing for you as a DJ. So, what do you do? You have to go into the BIOS and unlock the performance power plan. And I can't tell you how to do it, but I can share a video with you in the description of this video on YouTube from the Windows Club that takes you step by step and shows you how to go into the BIOS and unlock that performance power plan. It worked for me. I was freezing up after about a half hour, 45 minutes. And I didn't know what to do. I'd made as many changes as I could in the control panel to try to prevent this from happening. Eventually, I saw this video, I followed the directions, I unlocked the performance power plan, and I've had no more problems. This has been over a year ago on this Alienware M16 machine. My friend Todd just had a very similar problem on a brand new Alienware M18 machine. He did what this video told him to do, exactly what he told him to do, and no more problems. It's a little scary if you're not a computer person like myself to type in these long codes and do these things in the BIOS. But take your time on this video. Pause it if you need to. Watch it a few times. Try to understand it. Even if you don't understand it, just follow the directions and this could be the fix you're looking for. I will add this. A lot of these folks who I've talked to who have had these problems have reached out to our community and asked the question, hey, how do I fix this? I've got this PC, it's doing this, this, and this. And a lot of people have just replied, get a Mac. I know that a lot of you folks that are running Macs are very proud of your purchases. You've made a smart purchase, it's a great machine. But it's starting to sound a little smug and elitist when you just say, get a Mac. It's not helpful, especially for a person who's stressed out after they've spent several thousand dollars on a machine and tried to make an intelligent purchase for someone just to almost ridicule them for not making the same choice they did with a Mac. So it's the holiday season. Don't be a Mac hole. You may not mean to be, but it's coming off like that when you just say, get a Mac. I don't use a Mac for several reasons. And saying get a Mac when I have a problem isn't helpful. <laughs> but a video like this that takes me step by step to show me how to fix my problem is. So be a part of the solution, not a part of the stress. It's the holidays. Be kind. That's it. Quick video for you. I hope it helps somebody. If it did, let me know in the comment section. If this solved your problem, let me know. Thanks to the Windows Club and thank you for watching. Practice and enjoy.